contend with the milk with the older women. That's what you really learn. Oh. I heard baby alien was in here. Come uh, here, little puppy. Yeah, another surprise. Hey, baby. Oh. Ah. Now, what's up, guys? Listen, y'all know I did a video previously about former NBA player Joe Smith and his wife Keisha Chavis. Now Keisha Chavis and Joe have both been making their rounds on social media from different podcasts and they've been talking about the controversial video that came out where Joe Smith found out that his wife had an OnlyFans account. Anybody but myself, so why should I have to tell you my choice, my body, my body, my fucking choice. Joe, I've been talking to you about mad things. I've been asking for solutions to shit. You're not giving me none, so I created one. That's no solution. Not in my book. No you knew you knew who the fuck I was when you met me. Before. Before. Now Keisha previously was an adult star, if you guys didn't know. And she's been talking about him. Now she appeared on different shows, different podcasts, TMZ. And most recently she appeared on Cameron and Mace's sports show, It Is What It Is podcast. Now, before I get into these clips here, one of the things, the way she's doing, I don't know if this is just for publicity and he's on the train as well for them to make money, but she's just conducting herself in a way that a wifey shouldn't be. And we're going to play the first clip here and see this interaction between her and Cam and how it goes. Let's go. Um, a moving company called Major Movers and Cleaning. And then I also have a massage business called The Body Rub Babes. Nice. Are the, do The Body Rub Babes travel? Yes, they do. Are you one of the body rub babes? Well, I have been, but now I kind of like <laughs> kind of nervous be... to do anything. But if I wanted <laughs> you to be one of my body rub babes, like, uh, uh, would you be a body rub babe for me? Oh yeah, sure. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. because I, I I don't mean to be a professional <laughs> yeah. or anything like that, but I can't stop looking at your cleavage. It's it's you got. Yo, your cleavage oh, is popping, you. babe. Nah, nah, you can leave it how it was, man. You can leave it exactly how it was, man. I right now think about cleavage and the body rub babes, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, nah, don't cover no, high school. It's, not. it's it's like you know, um. <laughs> yeah, babe. <laughs> well, you already know what type of time Cam is on, man. But Cam, that's somebody's wife, man. So with that being said, they followed up and she actually came on the show and made an appearance and gave Cam a back massage while they talked about the situation with Joe. Let's get into it. Baby, where, where, where's your relationship at right now? Cause they act, I don't really know what's going on with my co-host right now. Yeah, they, you, they're you, not you, asking no question. Um, are y'all still together? Will this will this jeopardize it? No. So he's not going to feel. I'm not worried about it. No, but he's not going to feel any way about what you're doing. I mean, What's the last time y'all communicated? <laughs> uh, we were texting with each other over the last. Good, that's good. You're making progress. <laughs> so is hope for the future with y'all. Um, I don't know. Do you want do you want do you want it to be hope there? I want to be happy. This this is what I think from your comments. I think and you can tell me if I'm wrong. Uh -huh. Oh sorry. <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> you can tell me if I'm wrong. But I think that you was at a point a couple weeks ago where you wanted to fix this. And I think that you're having fun right now seeing what you, with single life has been treating you like the last couple weeks. Cause no. I'm just, I could be wrong, but last, Honestly. when, when, when we did, just saying real quick, when mm -hmm. we did the interview with you, you was like, you want to fix it. And today you saying, I just want to be happy. It wasn't the same answer from yeah. two weeks ago. Yeah, so so that's why I'm maxing. <laughs> so All right. Well, honestly, basically what it is that we've had um, a lot of issues. Not just financially, just with communication with each other. Um, 
Exactly. And I, I agree with Cam. She's getting this attention, this newfound attention, and she's seeing what it's about. She's getting attention from different dudes. And that's basically what it boils down to. Attention, money, people paying her. They paying her. She's in the limelight again. I'm not talking about the OnlyFans limelight, but she's in the limelight again. She may be getting back to her old ways. You've seen her sitting down with Baby Alien. With the milk, with the older woman, that's what you really learn. I heard Baby Alien was in here. Come yeah, here, little Poppy. Yeah, I mean another surprise. Hey, baby! Oh, yeah! Oh, my goodness. What is going on right now? <laughs> wow. Mommy can't take care of that baby, baby. Another you ready surprise? for this? Yeah, I'm you ready. ready for this? Of course. Yo, another surprise. I can't believe it. What? But Joe Smith was on Vlad's podcast, and Vlad showed him this same clip and asked him how did he feel about it. And let's go ahead and play that. That's still your wife. I mean, seeing that, does that does that bother you at all? Uh, it bothers me a lot. Not just saying that, but the messages that I get from people. Now, Joe seems to be a pretty cool dude, man. He seems to be pretty cool, laid back guy. Been going through different things in terms of being roasted for even wiping up a chick like that, especially this lifestyle or whatever. But if you're not holding down the bills, it don't matter what your wifey's background was. This is your wife. If she's doing all the work and if what she is saying is true, if she's doing all the work, if she's providing and she's holding down the household and you struggling and things like that. And I you know she was bragging about saying he was working for her with the moving company and stuff like that. But that's something completely different, bro. But if she has to go to something that goes to what she knows in terms of that adult industry, then that's what she's gonna do. But like I said, and I'll always say this, a freak for attention has no moral compass, guys. They'll do whatever. And like I said, if she actually did a scene with Baby Alien at this point, but that just says something in itself, where this woman is at at this point. I think she's a little bit older than him, but it is what it is. He's going on different interviews. She's going on different interviews. This could be a blessing in disguise for them getting a few checks and maybe them even doing content because people pay in to see it. But Cam just put a few dollars in her pocket and she probably, I don't know, man. This is just a strange situation, but that's a way for two people who were basically out of the public eye now you see them they were basically in obscurity but now they've been pushed to the forefront and you're like hey this is what's going on this is what's up with the lifestyle this is what's happening and it's a resurgence for some women to give some women hope that's in their late 40s early 50s like old girl Anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think. What do you guys think about this situation, man? How, how do you feel if your wifey was doing that? Comment below. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit me up on Linktree to book a one-on-one -on -one with yours truly. Purchase all my books, merch, t-shirts. Helps to support the channel. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. With that being said, much blessings and abundance. Stick around for the next video that's going to pop up on the screen below. That's where I'm going to see you guys at. It's your favorite everything. This is wisdom. I'm out of here. Peace.